So the second tournament in the race to Dubai produces another dead heat. As in Shanghai, 72 holes, not sufficient to sort out a champion. It's sudden death again and back to the 18th tee. And three very different golfers. Lin first up. Fairway metal. Oh, that is left. And right across that one. It's got to hang on. Is out of bounds on the left-hand side there. Reminiscent of James Kingston when he blew this tournament. He's actually done that twice, the South African. Down there, pretty much dead. Happily, he's won since then. Back home in South Africa. Now then, McElroy. Still the freedom in the swing. Great to watch. Down for the tee. And that'll be fine. Oh, that's a big three wood. A little flip wedge in from there. That is Sam T shot. Utility club for Molinari. Cup left wrist there, tucked in on the club. Neat swing. Bit right. Ooh, more than a bit. Right and quite short as well. Those trees might be slightly in his way. And it was from there that Alathabal hit that wonderful shot to a few inches to win this title in 2002. That was miraculous. This would be, well, nothing short of astounding. It's a miracle shot if he tries to pull it off. Well, need a Sevi Ballesteros for that one. Molinari. He can go over these trees, actually. He's all right. Hit and hope. Can't see the pin. In the air forever. Fantastic shot. Absolutely fantastic. The first blow struck. Pressure now on the other two. Well, Lin's going for the suicide shot. Surely no way he's going to pull this off. He's not going low. He's going over the top or through them. Hang on to your hats. He doesn't know. We don't know. Oh, we do now. I don't believe this, Phil. Second tournament of the year, and already a candidate for European Tour shot of the year. How Unbelievable. Is, and how is Rory McIlroy feeling? He's waiting all this time. The two players have played great shots, and he's got the most straightforward one of all. Can he stick it close? Big follow-through, plenty of spin. Oh, fantastic. What a playoff. Extraordinary. Molinari must have thought his second shot was reasonable. In the shade and putting first. This has to go in. On the left again. And they're all missing it on that top side. Well, he must think now his chance has gone. Surely one of these other two golfers are going to hold for birdie. Yes, he was second in the Mercedes-Benz Championship with Molinari back in September, and it looks like he's going to finish tied second again here. This was the putt he had in regulation play. He must know it. Left edge, firm. Oh, yes. Over to you, Rory. Molinari officially eliminated. Now will those youthful nerves hold firm? Memories of the Omega European Masters when he missed a short one, dispelled at a stroke. They go on. Or rather, they go back to the 18th tee. And that's what's at stake, 327,000 euro. And of course, for Lynn, an invaluable two-year exemption to the European Tour. Second playoff hole. First up, yet again, Lynn. Better. Much better. Perfect. 
and Lynn's ball there pitched almost where McElroy's pitched on the first playoff hole. Now you were mentioning the Omega European Masters, Kim. It was only four months ago that he lost McElroy, that is, out to Jean Francois Lucas. Slightly collapsed follow through on that one. Has this gone left? Oh, it has. Oh, we need some help now from the golfing gods. That's had a couple of ricochets. I don't know if it's a commentary, but he might well be close to it, Phil. Well, he's not up the gum tree, but he's certainly below one. Just caught the low stone wall that's down there. Could easily have gone out of bounds, so I suppose he should be grateful for small mercies. But he's going to be pretty much stymied. Mind you, after what Lynn did on the previous hole, anything's possible. Well, this is a suicide shot. He's going with a gap wedge to hook it around. You can't stop it on the green. Oh! Over the water, bending right to left. Oh, I don't believe what I'm seeing. Is that better than Lynn's before? Or equally as good? It's wonderful theatre. Oh, they say there's only one Ballesteros. I think there are more than one now. The reply from Lin Wen Tang. Cutting across it as usual. Perfection. Any more twists in this tale? Well, if McElroy holds his putt, it would be nothing short of extraordinary. Now one hand and several fingers on the trophy. Always drama here. Isn't it wonderful? McElroy's shot here was just truly something special. Trees all around him. Hooking it onto the green over the water, it's just not on. Got to be a high five for that, surely. But with Lynn so close, this has to drop. Awkward downhill. Oh, he knows he's missed it. That's a shame. But you can't say he's lost the playoff. Played very bravely indeed. And he might well have done enough, you know, to just squeeze into the top 50 in the world rankings. And if he remains there at the end of the year, Rory McIlroy, he'll get his debut at the Masters in April. McIlroy's had a fourth, a third and two seconds now. And this man has never won on the European Tour. He has now. And what a way to achieve the breakthrough. McIlroy did not lose that. Lynn won it, and in style. You know, in 1959, Chinese Taipei's Lu Liangguan won the inaugural UBS Hong Kong Open. Now, with golden symmetry, Lu's fellow countryman is crown champion. He has to thank the fans because the fans being very supportive, even though he's not putting well as he expected for some time, but the, the fans were supporting. So it's a confirmation for him now for winning the European Tour champion. Molinari and McElroy shoot to join fifth in the early stages of the race to Dubai, while Wilson stays second behind Sergio Garcia. But at the UBS Hong Kong Open, the win went to Lynn.